I'm here with Stuart Lewis, man of the match against Boreham Woods, and uh, I think it's fair to say today was a well-deserved 1-0 win. Yeah, I thought the first half we was uh, we was excellent. Probably didn't get our uh, rewards for for our dominance. Um, could have come in one or two nil up, but I thought the second half uh, again we, we dominated the game and uh, we got a great goal. Uh, some good work from um, Josh DeBayo and Jay Reason and uh, Innie finished it off. So yeah, but across the whole team, I thought we. Uh, we worked so hard and uh, dominated the game against a good uh, Boreham Wood team. What was your role in, in the side today? Um, I think sort of just to sort of mop things up in and around the midfield area, get on first, second balls. Um, they're quite normally quite strong in there. Kieran Mert is a good player at the level, uh, Ricketts and, and Shake. So it was a real battle in there, but I thought that uh, we dug in and as I say, we, we really, everyone pushed each other to, to get that result tonight and uh, I thought we thoroughly deserved it in the end. Now, now, of course, uh, as the game went on, it was still 1-0. Dover had chances, couldn't quite get that second goal. What, what, what's the mentality of, of you and the rest of the lads at 1-0 as that clock ticks towards full-time? Yeah, obviously you're aware of it. There's, there's no getting away from that. But I, I, I did feel that we was the team that were going to get the second goal. Um, obviously, Anthony Jeffrey comes on with his blistering pace. Um, mm. He caused them problems. And, and Nort's come on and, and Alfie Pavey. I thought they, they all added something to our to our team. And, and that shows the strength now of the squad. And I thought that we were more likely to get the second goal rather than Boreham Wood nicking one. But obviously, it's a, t it's a tricky scoreline, 1-0. But uh, no, we, the boys are literally we're buzzing in there. And uh, I think that reaction at the end with the fans and, and that little togetherness that we've got going I think uh, it's starting to, to roll on now Three wins and four and, and you look at a quick look at the table Dover within touch and distance of safety or, or certainly the team's just above them Yeah that's it I think that uh, mm. Maidstone lost tonight um, a few others got a point but to, to, we, we have, I know it sounds a bit cliche but we have got to worry about ourselves and um, I, I think I said it on, uh, to, on the Kent Online that we didn't get our what we deserved at Halifax, but we've put that behind us. And as I say, three, in, three wins in four is really good form. So if we can take that now into the next two league games and attack them, and I don't see no reason why we can't uh, pick up a few more points and, and that'll, be, that'll tee up a, a really good and enjoyable Christmas period for, for us as a, a team, fans and, and as a club. Now, of course, changing the subject, it's been a couple of weeks since uh, <laughs> since you became a dad. How, how's, how's life? Oh, it's brilliant. Uh, it's, I think so, it's just the best feeling in the world. I, I never realised uh, love like it. And, uh, yeah, sort of, it, it has sort of made me, made me feel differently. And, and sort of, I go home and I look forward to seeing uh, my partner and, and my little boy. So, yeah, honestly, it's, it's, been a, it's been a good few weeks, actually. So we've got two wins for Dover. My little boy was born and... Uh, everything's happy so um, I'm looking forward to my first Christmas uh, with him and, and my family so and if that can be backed up by a really good run for Dover then uh, it'll be a good festive period for, for the Lewis family and for Dover. <laughs> <laughs> it must help, must help you with that, those last few yards at the end there. Oh definitely yeah no it's um, obviously it's a local one Boreham Wood for me tonight so uh, yeah it's that, like, that last five ten minutes we've yeah. We've worked, we've worked so hard uh, in training on a Tuesday, um, and I think that shows what we've done in them last them last five ten minutes. That's what the training's about, and and we have literally we've worked our socks off in training, and I think that shows that I think we would have fit a team tonight, and and there was only one team that looked like getting a second goal, and that was that was us. Excellent. Well, well done today, Stuart. Thanks, mate. Thank you.